everyone, it's Shadow the Rat, and in this video I'm going to show you how I train my rats to do agility. Now we're going to be using a method known as back chaining, and this simply means that we're going to be teaching the last obstacle first, and the first obstacle last, and then filling in everything in between. Now the reason we teach the last obstacle first is this way the rat will be working towards what they know the best, and thus make less mistakes, and remember the course much better than they would if we were to teach it in a more forward to backwards method. Okay. To start off, we have to train our rats each of these obstacles on their own, so that they know how to perform them. In this case, my course is going to consist of six different obstacles. A tunnel, a jump, a chute, an A-frame, a closed hoop jump, and of course, the weaves. Here you see Latte learning to go through a tube, go over a jump, go through the chute, go over the A-frame, go through the tunnel jump, and finally, weave the cones. Okay, now that our rat knows how to navigate each obstacle on its own, it's time to start chaining them together. Set up your obstacle course in the way that you want your rat to run it. Now lure your rat around to the last obstacle and lead them through it. In this case, my last obstacle is the weaves, and I'm going to lead Latte through it and then reward her. Keep in mind that she does know how to do this obstacle on its own, however, we still want to lure the rat through it the first time just to cement in their mind what they're doing. Okay, so now that we've led the rat through the last obstacle at least once, now we're going to let them do it on their own. Lead them to the edge of the obstacle and then point them forwards. Once they've navigated the obstacle, reward them. Now it's time to add in the second obstacle. Here you can see that my next obstacle is a covered hoop jump. So now I'm going to lead Latte around to the covered hoop jump and once she jumps through it, click and reward her. Then I'm going to cue her to go through the weaves by just pointing her in the right direction and then rewarding on the other side. After I practice this a few times, I'm going to lead Latte over to the hoop jump, point her to it, and then only reward her after she's completed both the hoop jump and the weaves. Now we're going to continue to add each of our obstacles in a similar manner. Next I'm going to add the A-frame, then the chute, then the bar jump, and finally the tube. Once Latte can do all of these obstacles in a row for one click, she has successfully learned this course. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. See you next time!